Hey guys, Mary Jam, April 18th at 10 o'clock, and I'm still coughing, so I'm going to take some more Buckley's. <laughs> you guys know I love my Buckley's, if you don't know already, so first I'll take that with you guys. Um, and then I got to put the flower, I was going to do this a few days ago, put them in the jars, but then I just never got the time to do it. And I really want to go to the Holocaust Museum tomorrow, and maybe go to Metro Town. And get the photos printed, see if the Spuffles cat is there yet. Or, because sometimes some stores reorder things. So I'm going to try and do that tomorrow. It just depends if I'm still coughing a lot. Because, like, I've been coughing quite insane. Even though, like, I'm not going to uh, Walmart to get groceries or anything. It's just to print photos. Because I just did the instant U-Haul. I was just there and I want to look at the dollar store there. And I also want to go to uh, Michael's. So I was thinking about going to the Holocaust Museum first. And then <clears throat> go to um, Michael's because it's on East Broadway. <coughs> so you're still coughing. But it all depends if my cough is gone or not. And again. Uh, even my family said they all have the same thing. They're coughing like insane, but it's allergies. <laughs> but, I'm still taking Buckley's anyways, because you guys know I love Buckley's. Ah. <laughs> mm. uh. I was going to call my dad back, but my phone's, like, at 30%, so I'm like, I'll call him tomorrow. <laughs> I'm actually really tired, too, and my, I'm coughing so much anyways, so. Let's first put the flour into containers, so I don't end up having any bugs coming. So, yeah, we'll see how I feel in the morning. Like I said, I've been taking, um... Buckley's the cold medicine that I bought yesterday, so it's been kind of helping, but like I said, I still don't think it's a cold. It's, it's sinuses, uh, allergies. Everybody has it. <laughs> Everybody has it. And I like putting the flour in these jars because it's easier to pour rather than this. And then I don't have to worry about bugs getting into it because, once again, I live in a basement. There's lots of bugs in here <laughs> sometimes. So, and now I gotta buy a funnel. <laughs> Actually, not really. It's not too bad when I do it this way. But you guys can't even see. So, yeah, I gotta say, my dad's in pain because of his teeth. And he's like, nobody saw him. I didn't get a card for my birthday. I didn't get anything for my birthday. I'm like, well, if you check your email. I sent you the video of me singing, and all these people left you comments. <laughs> you said you saw it, but I guess he didn't, so. Oops. <laughs> I'm getting flour everywhere. <laughs> I don't think I really need a funnel. It's just a matter of how you hold the bag. And then I put away the groceries that I got earlier. So, like, I'm not going to record that because I'm just coming back and forth. And I heated up my food when I was doing that. So, there's one flour done. So, yeah, I had a nice time with family. And tomorrow, I'm with, um, tomorrow, Saturday... Me and Chris are hanging out with the family's kids all day, so I won't be doing too many videos on Saturday. Maybe, like, during the day, in the evening, and maybe play, like, a game of cards or something with Chris again, if he stays later. But, oops, now I need a flower everywhere. Okay, I guess I do need a funnel. <laughs> oh, you know what I need funnels for? Is, uh... The dish soap, when I try to put the dish soap in the container, it goes everywhere. That's why I do it in the sink. 
thought this was like a small bag of flour, but then when I put in these jars, I was like, huh, I already actually have two, two big, uh, things, and I got flour all over the counter, of course, so I'm gonna grab some more jars. I would take you guys with me, but I'm charging my phone at the same time. So, like I said, I'm at 30%. <laughs> That's why I'm like, I'll just call Dad tomorrow. <sighs> but, yeah, the, it's just kind of sad how it keeps going. Oh, I'm in so much pain. I'm like, so am I. <laughs> so, there's a lot of people. You just have to deal with it. Yeah. That's why I don't always say that I'm always in pain, because you guys should already know that I'm in pain. So I say it enough. <laughs> That's why I smoke all the time. Well, at least I didn't get that much water everywhere. And then I say, said in my last video that it looks like that I'm doing well, but I'm not. <laughs> I'm doing the best I can under the circumstances of losing my pets. I don't know if I'll ever get past it, but I know, like, some people, counseling helps them, but like I said, I do have a counselor, and they even say, too, there's really nothing, nothing that they can do except for listen, and, which is true, because, like, I don't know, what other tips do people, if you guys have lost pets, what do you guys do? Like, do you ever get over it? I know a lot of people have told me they're still not over their pets either that passed away 30 years ago. So how could somebody expect me to get over my three cats in less than two years? Josephine again is in uh, February. It's April. So it has not been that long. So I think a lot of people expect too much from me sometimes. I'm like, the fact that I get out of bed when I don't want to get out of bed is a huge thing. And the fact that I go out, even though I don't want to go out, is a big thing. <laughs> and I don't get enough credit for that, I don't think, sometimes. Oops. Just making sure... But I do find that the In Loving Memory Projects does help me the most. So if I'm sick, I'm going to be doing more In Loving Memory Projects tomorrow and more bracelets. Oh, no, I missed the power. Okay, I need a funnel. It's fine if a little bit of flour goes. <laughs> wow. Lots of jars. One, two, three, four. I should have grabbed another one. And now I got... I don't want to wipe down the counter again. Uh, maybe I'll just wipe down the part. I'll grab one more jar. Oh, I do have to go out tomorrow because I need shiitake, dried shiitake mushrooms because I didn't go to North Hills right after. So I was thinking about it. So yeah, tomorrow... I want to go to the Hogcast Museum, go to, um, what do you call it? I'm pretty sure my coughing's not too bad. No? Um, Hogcast Museum, Michael's, because I want to check out their craft section. Um,. Uh, no frills, and then, oh, Metro Town, and then, no frills, maybe on the way home. I don't know if I really need to, maybe I'll just buy them from Walmart, even though they are expensive. I don't know. <laughs> like, how badly do I really want to go all the way to no frills just for mushrooms, stretch tacky mushrooms? 
What's that word that I always say? Sometimes it's about the convenience. Not the money. And I knew I should have ordered it through... Oh, but then that's why. The no frills, the mushrooms are big compared to the ones at Metrotown. They're like small. So, oh wait, when I go to Metrotown... There's TNT. Never mind. Scratch that. <laughs> so yeah, I'm gonna go to bed early tonight because I want to get up early because I want to go to um like I said, I want to go to the Hogcast Museum first. Then I want to go to Michael's. Oops. This looks weird. <laughs> it's like. It's not full, one's full, but the other one's not full. Oops, there we go. Can I fit it all in one jar? Let's see. I don't think so. <laughs> so yeah, like, uh, so yeah, I definitely have to go out tomorrow now. Cause I just remember TNT has the best shiitake mushrooms actually. That are cheap. Well, they're a decent price. But <clears throat> when I go to Michael's, I'm not going to be spending like a lot of money either. It's just to go look. Because I haven't been to Michael's in decades. <laughs> so now I got one, two, three, four and a half hours. So yeah, I need to get a funnel. <laughs> Maybe I'll get one tomorrow the dollar store so when i go so start from the beginning we'll go to the hogcast tomorrow museum the hogcast because the hogcast museum and then i am going to go to michael's on east broadway then from michael's go to metro town because then i just go back to broadway station and then i hop on the train and then Go to the, what's it called, Metrotown, and then Metrotown, they have TNT there. I, I told it cheaper getting about that. It's like literally right by Walmart, like underneath. And they'll probably have uh, spring roll wrappers because I've been wanting to make my own, but I just don't have the time or the patience to do that. <laughs> I have so much other cooking that I want to do. So, then I want to, yeah, so TNT. The dollar store and then Walmart to the then that way I don't have to go all the way to the stadium to the TNT and yeah that's that's the plan for tomorrow and then Saturday I'm with family all day and then Sunday I'm going planning on going to church I mean technically I could wait till Sunday but like I said I really want to go to the Holocaust Museum ever since I heard about it so it wasn't that long ago, so I really want to see it, and if I could record it, that'd be even more awesome. So when I go there, I'm going to ask them, because I've actually seen photos of the museum, and they actually have stuff, photos of Anne Frank, and all the Hallcast stuff, and I'm like, oh, I want to get my photo with their and videos, and it'd be so cool <laughs> to be a part of history and have that in the background, because I'm very inspired by the hall cast because of Anne Frank. And I love to go to the Anne Frank Museum. My family actually went. But <laughs> you have to go to uh forget where German uh somewhere somewhere around the world. <laughs> so I'll never go there but yeah, it's pretty so that's what I want to do tomorrow because like I said I really want to go check out the Hall Cast Museum. And since I'm out I might as well do everything. And then Saturday, I'm with family for a bit. Like, pretty much till like 3 till 8 ish. And hang out with Chris, me and Chris and the family. So I can't really record too much tomorrow on Saturday. And then Sunday, I go to church in the morning. And then next week, it's kind of open. So hopefully, doing more stuff at home. As so I'm like, I really don't want to go out tomorrow, but I really need to talk to mushrooms. So. I need my plant-based oyster sauce. 
So yeah, um, hopefully I could film a lot tomorrow when I'm out. It'd be really cool if I could film the Holocaust Museum. That's actually kind of like a dream of mine in a way because I'm like, you guys know that I'm obsessed over the Holocaust survivors and like since I was a kid, since I first heard about Anne Frank, that's why I, I didn't say anything for so many years because people are like, Oh, you're a Nazi, you're a Nazi, you're a Nazi. And I'm like, I'm not a Nazi, man. Just because I like learning about the Holocaust and Hitler and all that stuff doesn't mean that... <laughs> I mean, I'm not... What do you call it? In uniform and all that stuff. So it's like, people are just so dumb <laughs> sometimes. <laughs> but, <clears throat> like I said, I do like learning about Hitler because I'm like, how can anybody follow him that's why me and my friend me and my best friend were so interested in him and then we learned about his career and everything like that they were lied to basically so it's like you kind of understand when you watch more about that so like i said if nobody if you guys haven't seen circle of evil yet that's like one of my favorite documentaries by about hitler <clears throat> so check it out it's on netflix but once again i don't support hitler whatsoever i only like that he's a ghost and that he's stuck here so he's in my top 10 ghosts <laughs> i'm surprised he's actually a ghost i'm like wow i mean for those that believe that so there's my flower so one two three four flowers i need another lid Do, 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 and I have no space to put anything. <laughs> uh. I'm going to put this in the pantry because it's just flour or sugar I don't put in the pantry. <laughs> this is how I carry things. <laughs> Be right back. And then, the other reason why I like having flour in these jars is because I know exactly how much flour I have compared to the bag I have to keep looking in it. So I have a lot of flour, <laughs> which is good because I got a lot of cooking to do. Now I just made a huge mess. Huge mess. Uh, right now I'm just kind of piling everything up on my oven. And... I gotta figure out where I'm gonna put all this stuff. Um, Merwin, I will put with the sauces for now till I need it. And then I'll ah, we'll wipe this down. <laughs> it's so bad I got flour over, over everything. <laughs> so maybe I'll bring you guys over here now so you can see. How much flour I got everywhere. So I need to get a funnel tomorrow for sure. I still have a hundred bucks, so it's not that bad. And that's a hundred bucks spending money. I have money in my savings. So money is decent for now. Uh, what should I do with the tomato sauce? Because I am going to use it. <sighs> I really want to get another shelf for in here because, like, I don't have enough space here, like, because I, I don't have the bottom cupboards. So that's the only downfall. So if I get, <clears throat> like, this black shelf that I have here, I actually got it from Yes for, like, 20 bucks a couple of years ago. So if I get, like, something like this, then I could add another one beside and put, like, my pantry stuff there. But for now, I have to put everything, and I'll bring you guys with me to the pantry room which I have to reorganize 
at some point. <laughs> I don't know when that will be. One one thing at a time, miss. <laughs> See, so like, this is all my, what I call my pantry stuff. <laughs> all my dry goods. So it's like, whoa. And I'll put the marinara sauce in here. But I have to be very careful with, like, I can't have sugar in here because last time ants all came. So I always hide the sugar. Sugar and peanut butter, those are the two things that you gotta hide if you don't want ants. And I used to be terrified of ants. I'm gonna put the marinara sauce in there. I'm not gonna go do cooking tonight. So I'm way too tired. But I did laundry. Yay! And I'll be doing laundry again on Saturday. Because I only did. So this is washed and I got all dirty again. <laughs> Story of my life. So I wanted to make the roasted garlic pasta, but I'm having leftovers. So we're gonna make my sandwich with my homemade bread. And I have noodles in the microwave. So I am going to oh I should put the with the sauces because I want to use this tomorrow at some point. And then I'll just like this. Oops. <laughs> I got flour everywhere. And yeah, I'm pretty bad at it right now. I'm just putting all the dishes in the sink. Because I'm too tired. It's 10.30 right now, by the way. And I still have not taken a nap. So I'm pretty much going to sleep. Right after I get my food together. So, but first, we gotta get rid of this flour. <laughs> so I'm just going to put it in the sink. For now, there we go, and then deal with that when I am awake, because I don't think ants really care for, oh sorry, water is on, <laughs> ants really don't care much for flour I don't think, you guys see that I'm cleaning my counter again. So, like, part of me wants to stay home because I want to do a lot of cooking, but at the same time, I gotta get shiitake mushrooms, so I gotta go out. And I don't want to use Instant Card again because I want to see if they have my cat yet. My cat Speckles doll. <laughs> so, if they do, I'm gonna buy it. Last time, I didn't have $15 on me, so I couldn't buy it. I was like, oh, so cute. But it's literally a stuffed animal that's orange. I know I talked about this before. It's orange and black with the stripes. And it literally looks like my cat speckles. But it moves and it talks. That person was like, oh, that's kind of dumb. I don't want a cat. I don't want a toy that moves and all that. But it's really hard finding... A cat that's not like Garfield, that looks like Speckles. Because Speckles kind of looks like Garfield, but not totally like Garfield. That makes sense. Because he was yellow with black stripes. And I've been looking everywhere. Like... <laughs> Making a mess. I've been looking everywhere online for orange striped cats, dolls, stuffed animals. Nothing comes up. Black fluffy cats. Nothing comes up. Unless it's like $600 kind of thing. <laughs> As I get trying to build the bear. See if there's a build a cat. But I'm like I don't have the patience for that. To do that. I think build a bear is just build a bear. I don't know how that works. But yeah, for now I'm just leaving the dishes in the sink, and then I'll deal with that tomorrow before I head out. I'm just gonna 
put the rest of the flour in here. So then when I'm at the dollar store, I'll check to see if they have a funnel. <laughs> so I don't make spills. But it was only a little bit of flour. It was like maybe that much that spilled everywhere. So it's not that bad. So now, I'm going to make my sandwich. Because I'm trying to cut down on Subway. <laughs> so even if I go out tomorrow, I'm not going to go to Subway or anything like that. I'm going to warm up my food and bring it with me. Or, what I might do, <laughs> I might actually go to Subway tomorrow and think about it. Because it's not that expensive, it's like six bucks. I'm thinking of the, because when I go to the Hallcast, I have to go to Maine and 41st and catch the bus there. And there's a Subway there, so I'll just have Subway first and then go there, eat out. Because I know if I eat at home, I'm going to fall asleep. So I always do. So here's my vegan white bread that I made. I wanted to get the stuff out for my sandwich. Uh, or, yeah. That's what sucks about having conditions. It's like, I want to go out all day and do all these things, but I know when I go out all day, I would be so tired. And Saturday, I'm with family doing laundry again. And Sunday, hopefully, if I wake up, church. I mean, I am going to set my alarm, but if I don't get out of bed, it's not the end of the world. I'll just go the following week, because this week I've been pretty busy. So... Uh, where is my do 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 ma ma ba 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 do 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 oh I don't have any onions but I have spinach. I have lettuce, and I have green onions, so I will show you what I do for my lazy, my lazy sandwich. <laughs> so I got my bread here, uh, my mushrooms, oops. And I'm going to have noodles. Oh, and then my sister was telling me that there's actually a restaurant that we used to go to back in the day. I forget what it was called, but apparently they served white food and Asian. <laughs> I'm like, that's good because that's what I do. I always have white food and Asian food before I go to bed. So my white food is my sandwich. And then my Asian food is the noodles that I made the other day. The chickpea noodles. Which I gotta put on microwave. So, I'm probably not gonna do another long video. I'll just show you guys what I'm gonna eat. But I don't have that much to say now. And I'm pretty tired. But I got spinach. And lettuce. And my homemade bread. That's right, homemade. Oh, and Gina Chef actually liked my post, my video on Instagram, so I'm like, yay! I like it when they do that. Because I make her bread all the time. This is the only recipe that I make because there's no need, but for some reason, it's only supposed to take 75 minutes for it to rise, or like an hour. But mine takes like two hours, but I think it's because of where I live, the humanity, whatever it's called. So, I will show you guys in a bit what I'm going to eat because I'm going to warm up my food so you don't have to hear the microwave noise and call it a night pretty soon, but not yet. So, like, comment, subscribe. And tomorrow we're going out because I got to get taffy mushrooms because I want plant-based oyster sauce because I make it myself. 
So yeah, um, talk to you guys in a bit here on Phantom Stories. Welcome to my haunted world, episode. So, G, Octopus. <laughs>